Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So you probably can see this is the fall seasonal surprise box. I'm super excited about this box. I um, was really excited because last fall's box was actually probably my favorite box of all time. And so I just had a feeling that they were going to do an amazing job. I know this video has been... I know a lot of people have shown their surprise boxes, but I wanted to show you guys and just give you guys my opinion on the products. I know a lot of people um, choose to wait, so if you haven't already seen this and you want to be surprised, probably want to click out now. Um, but those of you guys who want to see what's included, make sure to stay tuned. I also have a little announcement you probably already heard, but um, I will talk about that a little bit at the end. So this, the nice thing about these boxes are that they have the option to kind of reverse. So the quote on this box says, start each day with a grateful heart. Super cute. I love like the grateful um, quotes and stuff around fall time because it's so, it's it just reminds you that you should be grateful for the stuff that you have and not worry about stuff that you don't have. I feel like it's really easy nowadays to want things that you don't have. So I'm gonna put it off to the side and kind of go through with you guys and show you what is in it and my thoughts. So this is the little thing that you get at the top. It just tells you um, all about it. The box theme is Autumn Sparkle, which is super cute. And it tells you that you can upload an unboxing video and use the hashtag EC Surprise Box to get a free um, box going forward. So now it kind of shows you like an overview of what's going on. I'll show you each product. The nice thing about these though is that it tells you if it's a sneak peek or if it's an exclusive. Um, the sneak peeks usually mean that Erin Condren are going to bring them to the website. Although I have to say the last surprise box, which was summer. I, why did I have to think about that? That should be a clear cut thing. Um, they said that the cup was actually going to be a sneak peek and that hasn't come up yet. So we'll kind of see how it goes. But all of these items look pretty cool so I'm excited to look at them. Uh, before, I, before I go on, I should probably mention that the sneak peek is the pencil and the washi tape. So we will take a look at those right now. So the first thing that I see in this little package is a designer mechanical pencil. And I have to say, this is super cute. I've been kind of waiting for a product like this because I love their, I love their dual tip markers, but I'm not a huge fan of regular pencils. So I've been waiting for them to come up with something like this. And of course they chose like the prettiest color ever. Now I have had a lot of people comment, or not comment for me, but like I've seen comments on Facebook and stuff when they're talking about this. It does make kind of a weird noise, right? Like, it's kind of weird. I don't know if that's supposed to be like that. There are a bunch of grown men in little tiny cars outside. I the Labor Day parade is like right side of our outside of our house, and I decided to film now. And yeah, there's a lot of grown men in little cars. Cool. Okay. <laughs> it's hilarious. Okay. So anyway, don't get distracted, Sarah. So you have. The, the pencil. I'm pretty excited about this. You guys know that I'm studying, so pencils are always kind of nice for that. This is 0.5 um, lead, so that's also that also means that you're going to get a smaller a smaller point, I guess. So that's very interesting. I'm still just a little wondering what that is, if that's how it's supposed to be. So I know a lot of people have had issues with this, like it moving around. I have not, like I said, I'm just unboxing this now, so I haven't had any issues with it yet, but I will definitely keep you guys updated if I have any issues. And then of course, on the very top, there's an eraser, and you pull that off to get your, um, why can't, I wanna say ink, it's not ink, your lead. <laughs> so that's exciting. I'm, I'm definitely excited to see if they come out with more colors and stuff, because this is a great option. And does it say how much it was worth? $8. So, kind of expensive for just one pencil, but, I think if they come in a pack, that would be cool. Okay, so that's the first item. Let's move that off to the side. The next thing that I see are these really cute, like puffy stickers. And personally, I'm not a huge fan of these in my planner, but I think this would be really cute to put on a planner cover or a planny pack or something like that. And they mixed gold with rose gold, which is kind of nice because 
you're gonna see in a second they did do a cover with gold but rose gold is a common color I think for the fall so it's good that they gave you the option so that is that and then you also have a washi sheet this is kind of weird because it's very similar to like their normal washi sheets but I think this is like the see-through which is something that they seem to be like going more towards lately so I'll kind of show you see how it's see-through yeah you can see that so definitely interesting I haven't used a ton of these in my planner but I'm excited to kind of try it out it's so weird that it's like very similar to one of those sheets but now of course you get like skinny or washy it's kind of cool and then the next thing which I was super excited about was this clutch now I have to say when I saw this originally I instantly thought oh it's gonna be a planning pack like that's what it's gonna be why would they do anything different it is not but they did just recently release two new planning pack colors they have the um, pretty much the same color as this I think there's a maroon and then there's a, a burnt orange. So if you're interested in picking those up, make sure to use the links in uh, my description. Um, it helps me bring videos like this to you guys and show you all new products and stuff like that. Um, but this is definitely nice to have. I just wish they would have put the planning pack in because those are my favorite. Like I like the clutches. I've used the clutches as pencil cases before. I've used them for other things, but my by far, like besides their planners and stuff, my by far favorite product from Erin Condren are the Planny Packs. Like those are perfect. They're the most, they're like the best invention ever when it comes to planners because I always used to pull out my planner and be like, oh, I need a pen. And then I have to dig through my bag to find a pen. Not anymore. Now you just attach it and you're all good to go. So I'm excited about this, but I wish that it was a Planny Pack. The inside I've heard is really pretty. So you have that same like peacock feather look, super cute. You could use this for a lot of things. You could use this for makeup. In the past, I've used things like this for um, keeping, of course, my pencils in. I've used it for chargers and stuff when I'm traveling. So it's definitely a great option. I just wish that it was a planning bag. <laughs> so that is the next thing. And then you get some little things that I personally would be okay without, but it's kind of nice when you like the rare chance that you're going to need something so they give you they've always every time i've ever gotten one of these they give you note cards and like i said these are things that i could totally do without but on the rare occasion where i do need a card these come in really nice so it's kind of like a, a double-edged sword i don't know if that's the right way to say it but it's something that I don't need all the time, but when I do need it, it's nice to have. So I definitely hold on to these and I have used them in the past, but it's just something that like, I don't know, it's not super exciting to get. Then we have these cute little, I think these are sticky notes. And I'm surprised by these because they're not really fall like. They're more just, okay, so half of it is sticky. I'm just surprised by this because I feel like there would have been a lot of opportunities to put more of a fall color or like a fall design. I get that this is kind of their like go-to design, like the rainbow type of thing, but it doesn't really go so well with the whole box, in my opinion. Um, but I will definitely use these. I love having little notepads around. I love having sticky notes around. You can never go wrong with them. I just don't think it fits in the box so much. So that is one thing. Then we have two more things. We have this metallic washi, which again, I don't really feel like goes in this box. Like I get, I get that it's their color. Like they're big into turquoise. I get that. But I just don't think that it goes so well with the colors. Like even with the pencil, I kind of think that they should have done something like maroon. That comes off real easy. Okay. And it's like a very like shiny feel you would not be able to write on this at all but that is super cute definitely I think if you I think you could mm, I don't know you could possibly no I don't know if those match so much but this is definitely a great thing to have when you just want to do like a simple washi spread or like you could use this to decorate gifts or you know there's so many options for washi tape so that is nice and I'm excited to see if they just bring this one out or if they have a bunch of other colors and stuff too. It'll be interesting to see. 
And then the last thing that I have here is a new planner cover. And I am so excited about this one because I love flannel stuff. This is super cute. I've heard people say this too, but it is true that this is not just a fall cover. I feel like this could go really well with Christmas as well because I actually had a wrapping paper that was kind of the same print, but this is super gorgeous. And I think it just goes really well with like the fact that this clutch is also has like the ro the, the gold um, accents. I think that goes really well together. If you guys haven't already seen the new planning packs, which I think are in the same color, is also gold. So that's what I plan on using with this cover um, pretty soon. So I'm super excited about this one. I think this is probably one of the best ones that they've had so far. And I'm hoping that like going forward, it's kind of the same. Like they keep doing really good surprise boxes. The summer one was, I'm trying to think, it was okay. Um, but I think I, my all time favorite has always been that fall surprise box from last year. So that is my little unboxing. Those are my thoughts about this box. Now I do have something exciting to talk to you guys about. This video will definitely go up before the giveaway ends. If you guys haven't already seen, I'm doing seven days of giveaways. All the videos have already been posted and the post on Instagram, which is where it's held, is also posted. But the last day, the seventh day, I did include one of the fall surprise boxes in that giveaway. So if you're interested in winning one of the boxes, definitely go check out day seven's um, video and follow the rules and everything and post something on Instagram to enter. So anyway guys, I hope you have been enjoying all of these giveaways. I hope that you enjoyed seeing my thoughts and hearing my thoughts about the surprise box. I'm definitely pretty soon going to um, add some of these stickers and just make this really cute because I personally plan on using this for all of fall. I love it. Um, and yeah, so thank you guys again so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.